Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. So one of the things I like to do, um, I prefer actually the box method, but a lot of students like doing foil. And so what we're going to do is I'll show you how to do this by using foil, and then I'll actually do the foil face as well. So I have foil, which is F-O-I-L. And I think students like foil just because it's easy to remember when multiplying uh, two binomials. Now remember, foil represents first, outer, inner, and last. So what that means is the first two terms of each binomial, the outer terms of the two binomials, the inner terms of the binomials, and the last two terms of each binomial. So I like to when I'm doing FOIL, I like to label them just like how I did here. Um, and therefore, then all I know is, OK, to define the first, all I'm doing is I'm going to multiply the product. Because basically, by doing this, what we're simply doing is just saying, what numbers, what numbers do I need to multiply by? And what you notice by doing this, it's really just, just showing the distributive property that my 3x has been multiplied by both terms on the other binomial. So you could apply just using the knowledge of distributive property, but this is kind of an easy and fun way uh, to kind of remember this. And a lot of times I always like the foil face because you can make um, foil faces cool. So now I'm going to do is just do 3x times 2x. Then I do go look for my o's, which is 3x times 1. Then I do my inner, which is negative 5 times 2x. And then my last, which is negative 5 times 1. Cool. So now, ladies and gentlemen, all I'm simply going to do is just multiply and see my answer. So 3x times 2x is 6x. 3x times 1 is 3x. Negative 5 times 2x is negative 10x. And negative 5 times 1 is negative 5. Now, I notice that these two terms have the same variable factor of x, so I can combine them. 3x um, minus 10x is going to equal negative 7x. Now, I just, oops, I'm sorry, that's. 6x squared, right? Good catch. So now I'm just going to write these final answers as my trinomial uh, or as my product. So I have 6x squared minus 7x minus 5, or the product of my two binomials. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you um, use FOIL to determine the product of two binomials. Thanks.